everyone, and uh, welcome. Hope you're having an awesome day, and uh, of course, having fun. Uh, yeah, that's it for the intro. Let's get this video rolling. Okay, uh, you see I have the trench, which is back right now. It still is empty, but uh, right now, what I did do to it is I completely changed it, which means it is smaller, a lot smaller, and a lot more detailed right here on the top. So, uh, yeah, that's basically it for the changes in the trench. Now, uh, I still have a few things to talk to about, to talk about, uh, and those are two other parts. To other parts, to other building constructions, I have, I have done. For a reason, uh, you're going to know that reason at the end, so stay tuned for that. And if you actually want to know it, just make sure to stay until the end of the video. Okay, uh, now we're done with the trench, right? Yeah. I wanted to show you this. One howitzer, and it's not made to represent any kind of gun, real life gun. Um, however, it is kind of a tiny little mini Big Bertha. It was not a in initially it was not made to be that. However, I do, I, I like I do recognize when something looks similar to something from real life so uh, yeah that's the field gun it's really not that complicated it's essentially just an elevated gun on a support okay uh, and I have that done I, I will now that I have that done I will talk about something else again for the howitzer and sorry for my hand there. Okay, um, I found this, and it's essentially an elevated piece of ground. I know, I know how that sounds. So, it, it being what it is, I made it exactly as tall as the trench yep exactly as tall as the trench let me just get it down there oh, good. yep okay done and I uh, I've built it uh, especially to house this piece of artillery and let me just move the camera okay fine so uh, I built it to represent one of those uh, craters in which soldiers would uh, house artillery uh, just to know it's more protected and that the operators are not in danger of any kind of fire from the enemy. Okay, let me just get these out of the way. Okay, I gotta pick you up. Gotta Get it out of the way. Let me just get the trench out of the way quickly. Done. Okay. I have one more thing to talk about. And then we're going to get to the big surprise. And that is this new pillbox design. Uh, whoops. I know it's not new for you. It's new for me. Sorry for the camera. Okay, it's not... God. It's... Not new for you, it's new for me. Because I've tried pillboxes uh, quite some time ago. I don't know, like a few months. So basically, it's one of those tiny little, bunk tiny little bunkers. I cannot speak English, and I don't know why. So, um, they were placed behind trenches. Because the trenches would require covering fire. 
And the covering fire could not be provided by the tanks, as the tanks were their main attack and support vehicles. Uh, and they would be gone right after arriving. Um, so these were the solution. They were small two to three person bunkers housing an MG and they're just scattered all over the battlefield uh, just they're placed and built to fire upon the enemy and give support to advancing infantry okay uh, let me just get everything back into their positions I know I just took them out now I realize I shouldn't have you can't see the pillbox if I put it it will be that okay now you can't see this. Good God, I have to get a better camera. Okay, and the trench. Please tell me it fits. It doesn't. Good God. But it's fine. I know. I know solution. Okay, perfect. Um. So I was thinking about using these in a mock. Like the 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 year just hit me to build a mock. Um, so it's gonna be for the for ten subscribers, and I will be showing you the progress on it. Uh, these are just um, pre-built things I thought of before actually um, getting my Brooklyn quarter. Yeah, I I I'm waiting for a Brooklyn quarter, and I sincerely am not sure when it's gonna come, and that's a problem. So I will unbox both that and my brick crimes no actually it was brick mania the one i just ordered yeah i think i got my brick crimes already yeah um i ordered my brick mania set thing for the a7v uh with the brick arms kit for 5 mg mg08 and uh for Gewehr 98 for my German soldiers. Uh, yeah, that's that. Oh, wait, I almost forgot. I also got a book from Brigmania, and it's the Great War Instructions book, which will be quite useful uh, as I'm building World War One mocks right now. So if these World War One mocks get enough support from you guys, I'm going to start building other mocks from more modern era, World War II, Vietnam, things like that. Uh, yeah, so basically just remember to subscribe, remember to f just like, share, I don't know, do the thing, you're the one watching.